G'day guys and welcome back to the channel. We are here with the brand new show. This is Ted. Uh, don't know why they made this into a series. Well, I can't do it. It is a pretty fun. They're pretty funny movies. But I'm interested in the series because I know it's about when... Uh, was it Johnny first got Ted? And... Uh, way back when he was a kid so it's going to be interesting seeing him actually sort of grow up with ted so um i understand seth mcfarlane is actually involved in this so it is probably going to be pretty funny whether it's the same level as the movies or not we'll find out um it could be in uh probably in line with more of a family guy humor which we'll probably find out so let's just check it out man Okay, so this is actually the uh, teenage years of Johnny. Okay. Fucking midget. We don't stay midgets. Stay little kids. Keep it as it is. Life is rude. Well, that's just it. It's a fucked up quirk. I mean, how would you like it if you were an absurd thing someone called you? Well, okay. Yeah. That's not the same. Why not? You're a teddy bear. So what? You're a teddy bear. Sure. Yeah, so what? <laughs> I am a midget. I could tank you just as fast as He's a small bear. <laughs> Yeah, I wouldn't ask. Hey, get in. I am she. I was passed out by the Hong Kong buffet, so I could do the math. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> wow. Shut up, Meg. It is very much Family Guy dynamic. Really? Wow, that is weirdly so much more daring than anything else in there. Oh, it's not everything is daring, young kid. Are you sure it's not fucking real right now? I hear shit. Shit, not if it's dark as shit like this. <laughs> what? Did you cut the black body to a birth? Undeniable. As what? Why not? Besides, TV. Aren't you coming up with something? Yeah. Is he gonna be like a service dog? Like he's not technically human at this point, yeah? How can he attend school? Except he's okay. And what would you do? I I would tell him all the good stuff in the backyard, and then I'd lock the door behind him. This is like get home alone. It. <laughs> I want to see a pottery. Oh god. Yes. Nailed it. Come on, let us tell somebody. No, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It is pretty tense. Can very much hear Peter Griffin. You just call it a BB gun. Yeah. 
Turn on the TV. Holy shit. <laughs> Is this how we get sent to school? <laughs> Still don't know how they would accept him, but <laughs> her name is Beef Stroganoff anyway. <laughs> you can feel it. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Sorry. I'll stay out of school for now, okay? Majorly. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'll stay out of school. I was sent to art school because the best of my school. Ugh. Yeah. I was like getting the next man so they could say how much I stink as a person. Oh, that's stupid. And that's every day? Yep. Then I graduate. If you die in a drunk driving accident, you get a full page on life after that. Not quite a good night's name, but... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's something. Sorry, guys. I gotta lug these things around all day. I pretty much. Look what is a luncheonette? Sounds fine. You look like suicide bombers having a second thought. Shut the fuck up. You can't joke about bomb threats. Holy shit. What was that? Bethany's sister. She goes to Emerson and Connor's trip on the plane. Jesus. Okay, who's Bethany? What's her name? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> With all the stuff I don't have life for. Your wife is fucking that guy. <laughs> Things are funny, but you know what? Joke's on you, smart guy, because my wife and I are having sex. Oh, really? Wow. Sorry to hear that. That turned quick. <laughs> Okay. I knew there was one girl there. I I take it Dorchester's a rough school. I'm afraid that's true. Oh, hurry up. Oh, it involves making out during daytime, but the point is, I want the mother stinking finger and the dirt floor of the system to come out on the Not gonna be so hard to be kicked out, is it? You are going to make a successful student out of me. Now hang on a second. And you're the perfect choice. So if you want to act up again, just know if you do. Unless he does something so extreme, they've got no choice. No, Teddy and I are friends, and I played the El Bowl and the Fight in Title song. That was my idea. They've never done it before at all. Can we have drugs, please? Sorry? We just were looking to get some weed. We thought maybe you could help us out. How old are you again? Sixteen and a half. And he's a teddy bear. That's my fault. It's not for him. It's for me. Look, I get why you can't give a high school kid pot, but fucking teddy bears are not good, right? We all get drunk. The fucking Care Bears are all meth heads. The parents are on toilets, and the sergeants are coaches. You don't leave it in the room when John Belushi dies. Look, I can't help you guys out. I mean, Fuzzy's on something. Ah, that would be funny. And and might I say, you are a very beautiful woman, too. Yeah. Oh, God, I know. <laughs> Oh, wow. Did not expect that one. Hello, John. It's me, Teddy. One of your good ass Belushis. Yep. Sorry about what I said to you. Not that you two things aren't attractive, but I'm afraid in my heart we both know it. Let us not be so high that we have to call in a sick. Huh? That's what you hope for. And so it begins. And of course, there's a slow mo walk. X 
expectation versus reality, huh? I don't know who that is. It suits her. Is there a fucking gas leak or something? Okay, so he knows they're high, but doesn't know why. They are very good. <laughs> I mean, all they have to do is explain the situation. <laughs> he got up there faster. She's just staring out the window. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> Take it to school. <laughs> okay, so we plant the weed in my locker. Then you go to the principal and rag him up. He searches my locker and boom. Put it in someone else's locker. Don't think I've heard of it. Oh, yeah. And they ran out of pills for the other evil kids. Hmm. They're shitty, you know? They start on me. Like, like eat each other alive? Like they play me? Like, you give me your hand, I'll give you my foot? No, no, it's like some of the... Eat the dead ones first. You won't get your back until you're dead to them. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I couldn't do that. I knew the real me. Plus, it's all good. Wasn't there a recent documentary made about that, too? I don't know. That one's way over my head. Kind of, but not really. <laughs> Why does she would Oh, he can't answer my questions. Oh, Daddy, save her. Oh, God. Is that Mary Joanna? What do I do with a drug? We opened our coma today. She didn't have to say anything. A good one. Yeah. She's in family. Why does she have a drawer full of tuna? Did you know that textile polymers are so absorbent that they can barely produce a hair? They have to keep them to be useful. What? They're bulky patterns. They won't affect your bulky hair down the road. I didn't know you were saying that. It's a name. A person. Anyone. I'll be talking to you and remember. You mean yourself? You want it or not? Yeah. Okay. And That's... It's more weird now that you're not the one who's wearing the diaper. It's all about power. Forget that mom and dad thing. Why not me? Have that ice cream bar. You you will. 
What the fuck? What now? Jesus, we got a quick friend here. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Okay, what's in the box? I'm sure you wouldn't guess. Back when America could have used a movie like that the most. <laughs> anyway, Stallone felt really bad. Dunno. So he gave me this. What is it? A mouth guard? Holy shit! Holy fucking shit! Now I will give you this priceless item. <laughs> if you In exchange for Blair. <laughs> And no more charging a ran either. Oh, oh wow. I feel things. I I I feel them in my mouth. You got a golden ticket. Yeah, okay. Rocky would never have given us that. Oh a boy. The lie. Hmm. All right, that was essentially a near hour long episode of Family Guy. <laughs> really, I mean that's basically what it is. I couldn't help but picture uh, Peter Griffin <laughs> the whole time, just. Getting up to some shenanigans. Or maybe even Brian and Stewie. Like, you know what I mean? It's very similar. It's basically just a live-action family guy at this point. Um, some of it was funny. Some of it was kind of eh. Um, I did laugh a few times. Some of it was just at the absurdity of what they were saying. Um, and, and that's basically family guy in a whole, really. Uh, for me, Family Guy has always been hit and miss. Uh, sometimes it's funny, sometimes it's just boring as hell. And this seems like a mixture of the two. I don't know if it needs to be, you know, 40 to 50 minutes long. Um, uh, might be too long, but we'll see. It's only episode one. Who knows what the rest of the show is going to be like, but, uh, I'm still curious as to how they let Ted into school, <laughs> considering that he's not technically human. Um, so, I mean, they're probably not going to answer that question. It's just, he's at school and we move on from there. So, I don't know. Um, I will continue to watch it just to see the, the rest of the season and whether it's funny or not. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's all I've really got to say. It's just a, a live action family guy at this point. And I don't know whether that's a good or a bad thing. If you guys enjoyed this reaction and want to see more of Ted, be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and join me next time. See you then.